Hey, what's going on everyone? RC84 here, like always. Thanks for watching. Well, my friends, it's been some time since I've been here on the channel. It's been a while since I've uploaded anything. Well, that's a lie, because I actually uploaded a new video just the other day, hanging out with the guys, doing some crawling. Uh, had a blast on that. But uh, what the heck has been going on with me? How come I have not been uploading frequently to the channel and stuff? And I want to explain what's been going on with that. So last year, 2018, was a kind of a hectic and busy year for me. Uh, I was balancing my full-time job with my also doing my photography and video work. If you guys don't know, I do photography and video work uh, as a hobby and a passion of mine, something I enjoy doing. If you want to see my work, I will include a link down in the description box where you can see my work at uh, there on Facebook. But uh, I got crazy busy with that. I was traveling all over the areas. Uh, you know, filming, you know, filming and photographing landscapes and scenic areas. I got booked for doing modeling shoots, wedding shoots, senior portraits, uh, party shoots, and stuff like that. So I was all over the place uh, photographing. And then I have my auto detailing service that I, I do on the side to earn a little extra cash. So sometimes on the weekends when I didn't have any photography shoots, I was doing car detailing uh, to you know, earn a little cash so I can keep buying these little things here. But um, all that was happening and then uh, I actually end up meeting some uh, local guys here in my hometown who are into RC's there and I've been hanging out with these guys a lot hitting uh, hitting up with them going crawling and, and going RC and stuff and I have plenty of opportunities to break out the camera but I really wanted to run with these guys because there was a time period there for about a little over two three years I was by myself uh, I had no one to relate RCs with, to talk RCs, uh, run RCs with. Uh, the RC community here where I live at used to be big back in the day. We had two major hobby shops, well two big hobby shops. We had race tracks every week. There was something going on for racing, drifting, crawling, boating, flying, and so on. And then one day out of the blue, both the hobby shops closed up, the race tracks closed up. Everybody that I knew that was into the hobby of RC completely just vanished. And I don't know what happened to them. <laughs> so for the last two to three years there, I was running by myself. Which, you know, I don't mind being by myself sometimes because when I want to go RCing, I can just grab one of my vehicles and just go out and RC. I don't have to worry about calling up people, setting up a day, a time, and a place to do it. Uh, so, you know, I don't mind being by myself. But it's also nice to have that group of people that you can hang out with and run RCs and talk RCs and share the same interests as you do. And I really, really like that, my friends. So I've been kind of soaking it up and running with these guys uh, just because for that long time period by myself, um, I just wanted to run with these guys. So that's why I really hadn't filmed that much and we've been hitting up like almost every Sunday we've been crawling uh, my buddy Drew has an awesome rock crawler course at his house I actually started building myself one back in uh, late October right after Hurricane Florence uh, came through here in North Carolina so I started actually building myself one so I was like oh, the woods are all tore down and get back there you know I can I can make something of it so I did which I'll show you some videos on that here very soon so uh, that's really what's been going on my friends just a busy hectic year uh, and then uh, you know starting in 2019 I wanted to get back into doing the videos and sharing my videos to you guys and what motivated me to get back into doing this is that I received a comment uh, a few days ago from uh, one of my uh, viewers or subscribers who was mentioning about my video series on the Tamiya Hummer uh, 1025 that I did a build series back in 2017. He commented on it. I, you know, I'm saying he, or it could be a she, but I. Uh, they commented on the video and it's like, I just got, I just bought this vehicle. I don't know how to take it apart, what to do, where to find parts, and it's like, I found your videos and you gave me everything that I needed to know about this truck, where to find parts at, and he's like, without your video, I would be completely lost on this. And I was like, wow, that's pretty awesome that out of all my videos, uh, well, not all my videos, out of all the videos out there on YouTube, this person found me and saw the videos and just loved everything I was doing. So that really motivated me a lot, and then uh, other people commented, on some other videos like hey man 
Love your videos. Keep doing them. They're great. They're awesome. And that just motivated me more to get back into doing the videos. And I really miss doing the videos. And, uh, you know, when I filmed the first video of 2019, I was <laughs> completely just like out of the loop. I forgot everything that I that I was doing with my uh, with the, the filming of the RCs. And uh, so I was like, I need to start practicing and get back into the groove of doing these videos, uh, hitting out some more you know trail videos, some more boat videos, um, you know, fashion videos and stuff like that. I just I need to get back into all of that and do it again and bring this channel up to a higher uh, status, I guess, you know? Uh, yeah, but you know, I'm not doing this channel for the popularity or how many views I can get on my channel, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, on the channel or on my videos. I do it because I love doing it. I'm not doing it for the popularity, like I said. I'm not doing it for the money or anything like that. I'm not getting paid to do these videos. Was at one time, but now I'm not. But I'm still doing it. And I love making these videos and building these RCs and filming them and showing them to you guys, showing my RC adventures. Excuse me. Let me say RC outings, all right? I don't want to start anything there. But my, but my RC outings there. So uh, I just love doing it. It's a lot of fun for me. And it gets enjoyment, and y'all guys get enjoyment. Of, out of seeing my videos and I appreciate everyone that does watch my videos so yeah <laughs> so yeah so that's what that's what's been going on with me guys so uh, hopefully y'all will still continue watching my channel watching my videos if you have not subscribed to the channel please subscribe and hit that like button on all my videos I would graciously appreciate it if I said that word right I'll appreciate it if you did <laughs> And if you want to comment, hey, comment down there. Uh, if you want to ask about a question about a truck, or just say, hey, cool video, keep you know, keep the good work up, you know, whatever you want to, you guys want to put, you can put. Uh, that's the freedom of YouTube. You can allow, you can put anything you want on there. So, but keep it friendly, my friends. Keep it friendly. Don't don't diss me. All right, all right. I know sometimes I look like a goof and I do some things wrong and I say things wrong, but hey, take it easy on me. I'm human. I make mistakes. I clarified that in a video that I did last year about my disability where I have LD, which is a learning disability, and I explained that to everybody, like this is what happens with me and this is, you know, this is what goes on with me. So yeah. so. Uh, yeah, that's it my friends. I really have nothing else to say other than look out. I'm having some new stuff come to the channel, new videos, new vehicles are coming here soon. There are going to be some kit builds going on. So uh, you definitely want to make sure you stay tuned to the channel. There are going to be some pretty awesome build kits that I'm going to be doing here on the channel. But uh, so far my friends, nothing's really changed. Uh, in the RC room, I did end up getting rid of a few RCs. Last year, I calculated that I got seven new RCs. Seven, seven new RCs. I uh, started off with the Tamiya Conkhead 6x6, then the uh, Axial SCX-10 II. I ended up getting the QX4 Miniature Rock Crawler. I ended up getting the Traxxas M41 wide body. I ended up getting the uh, FT11 RC racing boat. And then the last vehicle, which is number seven, is the Trail Finder 2, which I got to do an update on that. Actually, both of these vehicles, I got to do updates on those uh, for the channel here because there's a lot of difference on both of these vehicles that I've done and I need to do that. So yeah, so uh, that was seven and I'm hoping to get more this year. Like I said, I got a few builds coming on, so make sure, <laughs> tongue tied. But make sure you stay tuned to the channel for those builds and everything. It's gonna be great, my friend. It's gonna be really great. And uh, yeah. Well, my friends, thank you for watching the video. I appreciate it. And I will see y'all in the next upcoming videos. So. Thanks for watching. See y'all later.